Morning. Good morning. Timmy the Trout. It's a new fantastic children's book. Timmy lives in the River Wharf. Where's the River Wharf? Alice! All the action started in Hubberham where we will go to our reporter Alice Rackham now. Can you hear me Alice? Yes I can hear you. Here we are at Hubberham to tell the story about the book. Here's Alex and Alice. Timmy is feeling bored so he decides to go on holiday but everything changes when he changes a group of expert jumping ground to <laughs> jump a 25 foot bridge. And you wrote this didn't you Alex? Yes. That's excellent. Well the bridge is actually over there. So it's not This is the tale of the ghost of Leaping Leroy. One day in 1929, the river next to me was flooded. Leaping Leroy decided to jump the 25 foot bridge just behind me here. But sadly, on his income to the water, he hit Headbangers Rock just in front of the bridge. I will now show you it in slow motion. Leaping Leroy ended up in the hospital just across the road. And that was the end of the brown trout. You can just collapse them. Yes, well, no, we've got chickens and um, the vicar's coming. Oh, is he? Oh, fantastic. It's church warden and the vicar's coming, apparently. Okay. Henry, where did um, Squadron Leader Brown Trout start from? Well, he started from top of the river, mm. came down really fast. Those are the 3 2 1 takeoff rocks. So he hit them, went up. These cows are all the crackers. Oh, 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 And he um, oh, jumped over. Oh, God. Oh, that's a very that's ugly. ugly. That is yeah. ugly. And oh, 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 this big cow and <laughs> that somersaulted oh, onto here. Oh, oh, then Megan the sheepdog pushed pushed him off into the water and <laughs> that's Headbangers Rock there. Okay, camera's rolling and away you go. Hello, my name's P.T. Yorkston. I'm the vicar of the parish here at Hubberhome. Uh, and I'm delighted that we're using the church and the bridge uh, to... Uh, <laughs> as, as part of this, uh, this story. Uh, the imagination is wonderful, but this uh, imagination is earthed in a real place where there's the bridge and the church and the stone. Uh, and it's lovely that when people read the, the story, they can come and visit uh, and see the context where Timmy had all his adventures. Bangers Rock. One line. You know, 
in a nice quiet line, you won't get anything. Typical head teacher. Here's Megan with her t-shirt. Megan, why don't you tell us a bit about this t-shirt? Well, I've got Timmy jumping and I've got Colonel the Crayfish, which is Timmy's trainer, to help him jump. Um, and then I've got some few other fish in the river. And I've got Meg sleeping by the house. And there's inside Meg's owner watching telly. And flowers outside, and then hills in the background and the sun and everything around it. Is that a real microphone? I don't know, what should I do with this? Should I plug it in? Here I am with Mrs. Taylor, the head teacher at Kettlewell Primary School. What difference has it made to be involved with this book, Timmy the Trout, at your school? Oh, it's made no difference whatsoever. OK, Aaron, could you tell us why you're dressed as a chicken? Well, because we want Ian's book published by Chicken Aaron! Yeah!